Yeah, I think Kumo, um, I'm thinking that's going to be your game name from now. So listen, uh, what I'm here, bro, I'm here to look at this 27%, get that to up to speed. So um, now what what I'm observing here, that's fantastic. I like that. You know, you've got uh, mortar men in your first level defense. Uh, I'd maybe try and get another couple of uh, mortar men in that first slot. So have like five mortar men in your first, five in your second, and then whatever you want in that uh, setting. But mortar men in these uh, in these barracks uh, positions for me do act like another uh, salvo or something along that sort of line. So really, really good. Uh, I'd probably start to take the machine gunners out because machine guns aren't causing anybody any bother, and maybe change them for mortar men. Snipers, if you've got them, would be superb as well. Um, now this is good, the fact that you've got 10 seconds, 20 and 36, so obviously after 30 seconds you're going to have a few vehicles out there. But if you look, you you haven't got either the PK or the Humvee IFV, they're great things to have. You really need to be looking at uh, getting those in there. Um, we, I've, I've pinned a continuous fire onto your uh, notes because we need to show you how continuous fire works. Um, uh, now at the moment you're going to have to use and spend crits to get your Humvees to level 4, where um, if you well let me put that a different way if you wanted to build another humvee you would have to spend your crits now if you get the humvee ifv which is a far better vehicle in these early stages you don't use crits to build them you use money to build them so it's 100k per vehicle you can get a nice fleet of vehicles uh, obviously it spends a bit of money but you get them and then you're just using your crits for upgrade so it's important you have a little look at that Get these abs uh, upgraded ASAP. You need uh, uh, more of them, certainly, and, and a lot stronger uh, than a level 4. Uh, helicopters is fine. Now, you're doing well on your Cobras, the level 8, mate. Get some more of them in your, in your defence. It would be my uh, best advice there. Um, there's possibility of getting the thunderbolt i'm not sure i'm going to do that yet i'll i'll let you know going forward but if you look at your alpha here you've got four tanks mate four tanks uh and then obviously some soldiers and then some helicopters so i'm not sure how that works as an attack method for me because i'd be i'd be thinking that you're trying to smash your way through now i, I generally run with two tanks and the rest uh, some sort of continuous fire vehicle uh, so it's a little bit more subtle but it might be how you're attacking we need to have a little look at so we need to have a little look at a tack method so we'll pin that as well for you brother okay okay so uh, yeah the reason why i asked you to invite is i left the game by the way i'd left the uh, the platoon um so i was an enemy so i needed you to invite us back about the team again Otherwise, I couldn't get past the uh, the the boundaries. Okay, so first observation on your base here, you, you're getting the end essence right. You've got uh, a great um, a perimeter there, which is forcing people out to to spawn quite far out. But um, if you imagine your troops and your vehicles here, they're gonna, I think, be able to escape. I mean, I'll tell you, we'll put it to the test, bro. I'm not gonna attack you, but I'm going to just park myself over here and we'll see what happens so watch these soldiers see what happens yeah they're away they're away they're away you know that see, see what's happening so I'm just gonna I'm just going to stand over here, mate. I'm not even going to bother myself coming over. So I haven't even needed to move, mate. You know, um, your your defence has come to me. I haven't needed to come to your defence. So that is the difference um, between... I'll just finish these guys. Okay, so on my base, what's happening is that all my um, all my mortar men and my vehicles, they're all encapsulated in these walls. Uh, they basically uh, can't escape because the walls um, are tight around them. So 
basically yeah, I've got a really tight perimeter on on my uh, defenders and that stops everything escaping I mean you, you're nearly there bro you just need to close all these walls up so nothing escapes so I mean if I surrender on this uh, for you and what we'll do we'll have a little look at uh, my base so a couple of days ago I'm level 33 so we're not a million miles away from each other um, but let's have a little scanny that's not going to do me attack care percentage any good is it right okay so war zone Come on, come on, come on. Base. Okay, so this is uh, this is my base. So if you were to attack me, um, what would happen is that my soldiers, my mortar men, my vehicles will be trapped inside these walls, so they won't come and get you. You've got to come and get them, and that's exactly what I want because then you're gonna to have to face me salvos. Um, you're gonna to have to face uh, obviously machine guns and things like that. I'm well protected on air and things. I think with the flax. Uh, but the other thing as well, if you attack uh, any of these turrets, you're pretty much gonna get picked up by another turret. Uh, that's what I'm trying to aim for. So you know, good amount of overlap. Um, so you know, it's very very difficult for you to hit one without getting hit yourself. That's that's my aim of my base. Uh, my footprint's very very small. Uh, my spawn zones are really far out as much as I possibly can. Uh, I'm ju I've just I literally got a uh, level um, thirty five now. So I've just upgraded my CC. So now I can get my turrets higher and things along that sort of line. So I'll be increasing the uh, uh, my, my my turret uh, attack. Uh, I don't want to upgrade the platforms yet, but I want to upgrade the actual turrets themselves. So I'll be maximising that. But um, I'm just aiming for this really, really sort of tight wall method, uh, nicely spread out mine. So when people are trying to encircle it and pick things off, they're going to going to face a little bit of bother there. Um, good anti air, air defense. Now, if you look at um, my turrets now, up until a second ago, I was maxed out. Now I've obviously upgraded. Um, I can now upgrade everything uh, yet again. But up until that point, every single turret had every single weapon absolutely maxed to its uh, to its full. So that gave us a really good attack uh, method. And if, if the game changed or if I felt, you know what, I'm vulnerable in one way or another, then obviously I can um, I can then adapt and, uh, you know, change my uh, my defense accordingly. If you're not already doing it, by the way, get in there and watch your videos. So obviously I've got a few defeats here doing all these uh, base assessments and things like that. But uh, watch every video. If you win it, watch it. If you lose it, watch it even closer and just find out what you're doing uh, and what, what you can change. Um, but that's initially what I'm suggesting. So I think you need to look at continuous fire. I think you need to obviously look at getting a few mortar men extra in your base. I think you need to tighten up these uh, these walls particularly so that you know your, your, your troops and everything can't escape. Uh, and it generally means that then you've got to come in to get rid of uh, the troops and you know what you break that wall you break that wall and everything's spawned um, then not only are you going to get absolutely shit kicked out of you by my salvos you're also going to get shit kicked out of you by about up to 20 mortar men uh, and several vehicles all at the same time now i don't care how good you are that's very very difficult to overcome uh, unless you've got these Zeus and you sat out here doing absolutely nothing, uh, you know, from a distance away, which uh, is obviously happening a little bit. But that's obviously what I'm aiming for. Uh, have a little compare against what you're doing differently, and then uh, we go from there, brother. All right.